magic. It was actually our love scene. Because that was also the first time in my life where I actually did proper love scene. Shashan sir says, here I need to shoot the climax of the love making scene. And then he goes like, okay, Viraf, come. <laughs> and, and not just me. And then the whole unit was like laughing at us. Hi, I'm Eli Avram and I am portraying Mrs. Sylvia Nanavati in The Verdict State versus Nanavati. Hi, I'm Viraf Firoz Patel and I got lucky and I get to play Prema Hoja in The State versus Nanavati adaptation of Al Balaji. It's called The Verdict. Kavas. Maneksha Nanavati. I am so impressed you said that Parsi name so well. Oh, I did? Yeah, it's usually Maneksha, but you at least said Maneksha. It's just really cool. Oh. I'm very impressed. <laughs> you, I don't know about their pointing system. You get five from me. Oh, thank you. Three. There were two boys and one girl. Three. I should know. Oh damn it! She's like <laughs> she's really scoring on this one. Yeah, three. I know because I was shooting that. You know, they shot me three times. A uh, police inspector uh, who was in Kolaba Station. Uh, what was his name? Right? We should know his name. Was it to he's the a police in the uh, show. inspector? Wasn't it the first? So to the his first general? person he went to his senior. Yeah, and, huh? right. And he said that go and uh, uh, turn yourself in at the cops. Yeah. So uh, he went to the cop station and said, "I've killed a man." And well, I know the actor who is playing that character. Can I tell his name? Does that qualify? Rajesh Kera, very talented actor. Rustam. Acha, isse pehle. Yeah, I know. Oh shit. Vinod Khanna uh, won. I mean, this was yeah, written by Gulzar Saab. Oh God! And uh, yeah, I and know this. Yeah, this but but no, I won't remember yeah. actually the name of it. One second. But yeah, I remember when I googled uh, up and all I saw. Oh gosh! Mm, I wouldn't know. Yeah. Nineteen fifty-nine. Some saving grace, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, good you said that. Yeah. Vijay Lakshmi Pandit. Okay. <laughs> See, I'm like that student, you know, who was like knows the answer before the question. I think uh, for me, it had to be those intimate scenes that I had to do with Ellie, <laughs> because I was thrown off with the surprise it got to me, and it's not. I have been acting for a while, and I realized that how difficult it is to make this stuff. To look real, uh, how difficult it is for your co-actor also that space suddenly the result is supposed to look steamy, intimate, sensual, etc. But the process of it was really how it's so you know. technical, like yeah. a little bit, like a little bit there, yet yeah, to the left. Now look up, and now you know. <laughs> yeah. So all yeah. the ev even all the. Any libido that you even imagine to bring into the scene to make it look real just goes out the window. At least, for, I think there should be a separate acting school for those kind of scenes. No, but that is why intimate scene acting school. No, but that is why there are acting schools, like really good ones. But they didn't teach me any of my acting schools. This. Well, then I don't know what acting school you went to. Yeah, but there are which good school did you go to? I want to. Well, go I'm to talking about abroad at least. Abroad? I know there are very. You work on all kinds of elements, so nothing should feel uncomfortable or weird. For me, I would say um, it was actually the day when I had to shoot um, in the courtroom um, and I had to uh, do the scene of when Sylvia reads out her love letter um, that she had written uh, to Priam. She has to read it out in front of everyone there inside that court. Uh, so I was nervous about that one because I remember also that Subhash sir, uh, after the, the script reading, he had clearly told me, you know, like, you know, this scene, Ellie, like, if you can just nail this scene, then, like, nothing like it. And just, like, he gave me one advice, like, what he wanted me to focus on uh, while I was doing it, you know, how to keep my eyes and, and all. 
and it stayed it stayed in me of course you know because I was like gosh I have to nail this scene you know so I was very nervous that day because uh, it's quite you know a long letter and also because you know all the actors were inside there all the junior artists so it was literally feeling like Sylvia in real life when she had to do that in front of so many people. That, that's pretty much the money shot of the show, right? Sylvia in the yeah. witness box. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was actually our love scene. Yeah, yeah, because that was also the first time in my life where I actually did such a, you know, like proper love scene. You know, so of course that was like challenging and I wouldn't say embarrassing, but yeah, it was challenging. I think uh, going back to the love scene, I, there is this moment I can't forget and uh, Shashan sir says, okay, you know, here I need to shoot the climax of the love making scene. You're like in the motion and then just give me an expression which sort of denotes climax. So I'm like, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, okay. And he says, action. And Viraf is doing the action. And then he goes like, okay, Viraf, come. And I just burst out laughing because who says come for that? <laughs> and, <laughs> and not just me. So it was just, it was me doing what I had to do and then going. <laughs> and then the whole unit was like laughing at us and Ellie and me were in some astronomically <laughs> challenging position. And we were like, just looking and laughing at the silliness of that moment. So does that qualify for embarrassing enough? Breaking Bad. Peaky Blinders or uh, The Good Place? Yeah, very like light one, fun. No one. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> I mean, not to sound rude, I'm just very honest. I wouldn't mind dating myself. Let me just sort of make that more interesting. I would love to take Saurabh sir on a date, just <laughs> to sit and talk to him. Because yeah, he is kind of so full of trivia and he's such a fascinating mind. He's a very enduring person, so... And he's cute like a teddy. Yeah, yeah, for, not for me, <laughs> but... Uh, I've actually squeezed like, his cheek. Saurabh sir is like this... Uh, stalwart mind who one would love to hang with so yeah there yeah, is definitely a as lot politically to incorrect this sounds i'd like to take saurabh shukla on a day but nandiji forgive me i didn't mean it that way but you know. in in real life or if he has done it has he am i <laughs> I was just confused, you know. Yeah, it has happened, but I just can't remember. But I think pickup lines are very necessary for these days. I, I because people have. Yeah, but not sleazy ones. That's just like. For leave respect, me alone. Pickup lines, but nobody tried to give you a nice pickup line. I'm shocked. Come on, Ellie. Oh, nice ones. I've got many. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Ellie has a problem. So many pickup lines. How will she remember? It's <laughs> sorry, Ellie. We understand your problem. Yeah. And I don't have any pickup lines. Besides the rickshaw. So I don't know. Hi, this is Ellie Avram. Hi, this is Viral Feroz Patel. And you're watching us on Midday.com. Subscribe to Midday India. Get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon.